I'm Inge, the beauty director, and I'm here with Francesca Neal of Collection Cosmetics. And today we're going to show you how to achieve the same look with either cream or powder cosmetics. On the right hand side you're going to use cream and on the left we'll use powder. I like to start with the brows. To begin with, comb them into shape with a disposable mascara wand. When using eyebrow powder, I like to go for a kit that lets you custom blend your shade. Make sure you wipe off excess product on the back of your hand before applying. Start by adding soft strokes to the middle of your brow, working your way towards the tail. Then use the lighter colour from your kit from the inner corner, blending towards the middle. This keeps the area softer for a more natural effect. Once perfected, set the brow in place using the brow gel. Choose a brow pencil in a colour that's as close as possible to your natural brow colour. Practice doing short, sharp hair strokes on the back of your hand. Fill in your brow with tiny hair-like strokes, starting in the middle and moving towards the tail of the brow. Finish by doing the same from the inner corner to the middle. Keep this softer than the outer half for a more natural look. Before applying powder eyeshadow, prep the lid with primer. Then use a soft, fluffy eyeshadow brush to apply the powder eyeshadow in a chocolate brown shade. Blend this all across the eyelid and up to the crease. Make sure to blend out any harsh lines using soft, circular motions. Now use a small, firmer brush to blend the same colour along the lower lash line from the outer corner to about three quarters of the way across. For the cream version of this look, again prime the lid, then try collections work the colour eyeshadow pencil in hot chocolate. Apply this along the lash line and onto the entire lid. Use the pad of your middle finger to gently press the cream into the skin, blending it across the lid and into the crease. Again, being sure to soften any harsh lines. Finish by tracing the lower lash line with the same pencil, smudge with your finger to soften. Take a small angled brush, slightly dampen this on a makeup wipe. Select dark brown or black powder, dab the brush, then wipe the excess product on the back of your hand. Trace a thin line starting at the inner corner of the eye, gradually getting thicker towards the outer corner. Using an eyeliner pencil, start in the middle of the lid as close to the lash line as possible. Trace a line that gets slightly thicker towards the outer corner. Stretch the eye to smooth the skin as this will make application easier. Connect the line from the inner corner to join in the middle. You can use tiny strokes if you find that easier. Take a large fluffy brush and swirl it round your powder blush. Find the apples of your cheek by smiling. Apply the blush in circular motions to the fullest part of your cheek and blend out along the cheekbone. Apply a few dots of cream blush with your finger or dab collection speedy blush directly onto the apples of your cheek and along the cheekbone. Use the pads of your middle and index fingers to press and blend the product into the skin along the cheekbone towards your hairline. Blend out any harsh lines using soft circular motions. Always start with a tiny bit of product. Layering is easier than taking away. 